Hey everybody, I'm Tony, and today I am excited to show you how to open multiple instruments in a single instance of complete control, and how to activate light guide support. So let's jump in and create an instance of complete control. And for this example, let's create a band. We'll start with drums. Okay, now that we have our first instrument loaded, we can change to the contact GUI. And you can see that the keyboard matches the virtual keyboard in contact. So I'm going to minimize the instrument just to make it easier to load more. So let's move on to bass, shall we? Okay, I think I like this one. Now guitar. Okay. And finally, let's add some keys. That'll work. All right, next up, batch configuration. So let's scroll down to batch functions. First option, clear output section and create an individual channel for each instrument. Click yes. So you can see that contacts done the work for us now and created a stereo output for each instrument and named it. Now we can move on to setting up the DAW. So we'll open the instrument panel. You can see our instance of complete control. We'll click that. And that opens up 16 MIDI channels. And of course, one's checked, which is the drums. So we'll click three more. And you can see that it's added three more channels to the mixer. So let's do some housekeeping. It'll come in handy later. Okay, now we have to create our tracks. So let's right click and duplicate three times. And again, the housekeeping. Okay, now you can see the setup for drums, which are currently activated. We're on MIDI channel one and mixer channel drums. So let's move through the others. The bass will be on MIDI channel two and bass channel on the mixer. Now the bass is activated, but the light guide hasn't changed. 
So all you need to do is go over to contact and click your mouse on the outside of the instrument box. It takes a bit of getting used to, but you'll get the hang of it. And once the orange box is lit, contact will activate that instrument and the light guide. So let's move on to guitar. MIDI channel 3, mixer channel guitar, and finally the keys on MIDI channel 4. And then keys channel in the mixer. So drums, bass, guitar, and keys are all active in separate mixer channels. And all you need to do for light guide activation is, is click on the instrument and contact until you get the orange box. So I hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, do me a favor and like the video and subscribe if you feel like it. We'll see you on the next one.